Hello. You're wondering why I have this big watch, aren't you? You know what? We're going to be some fun stories about telling time. What time is it? Well, you know what? It's time for us to read some books. What's the time, Grandma Wolf? Written and illustrated by Ken Brown. There's a wolf in the woods and everyone said she's big and she's bad and she's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone. She's mean and she's scary. But we wanted to know. So we crept a bit closer. And Piglet, who's brave, shouted, What's the time, Grandma Wolf? And she opened her eyes. They were very, very big and yawned. It's time I got up. So we crept a bit closer. And Fawn, who was shy, whispered, What's the time, Grandma Wolf? And she picked up her ears. They were very, very big and said, it's time I brush my teeth. So we crept a bit closer. And Crow, who is noisy squawk, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? And she took down the kettle. It was very, very big and said, it's time I scrub the stew pot. So we crept a bit closer. And Squirrel, who sassy squeak, What's the time, Grandma Wolf? And she fetched a sharp axe. It was very, very big and said, it's time to chop the wood. So we crept a bit closer and Badger, who's bold, bark, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? And she picked up two pails. They were very, very big and said, it's time I fetch some water. So we crept a bit closer and Duckling, who's silly quack, oh, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? And she looked down her nose. It was very, very big and said, it's time to light the fire. Uh-oh. You see how close those animals are? So we crept even closer and Rabbit, who's reckless giggle, <laughs> what's the time, Grandma Wolf? It's dinner time. Oh, oh my goodness, look at their faces. So we all settled down to vegetable stew and old Grandma Wolf, what did she do? She read us our favorite story. The end. Oh, that was a fun book about telling time. It was time for Grandma Wolf to fix some dinner. I was a little bit nervous on that. I hope you were too. It's About Time by Stuart Murphy. Oh, look at him. He has a little watch. That is so much fun to be able to wear a watch. When you get a watch, that means that you are responsible. It's about time. Wait a minute. That says 4 a.m. He looks like he's flying. That can't be right. There we are. Wake up time. A great big stretch. Oh my goodness. It's 7 o'clock in the morning. Time for school. Hurry up. The clock says that it is eight o'clock. Nine o'clock, it's time to learn and time to play. 10 o'clock, time with all my friends. Oh, they must have recess at 10. 11 o'clock, now it's time to go back home. Noon time, it's time for lunch. One o'clock, story time, my favorite time. That's my favorite time also. 
two o'clock. Then for me, it's shh, quiet time. Three o'clock, soon it's time to jump and run. Four o'clock, time to swing up high. Five o'clock, how about time? I do my best. Six o'clock, dinner time. Oh, yuck, it's peas. Seven o'clock, bath time now, but I'm not dirty. Eight o'clock, bed next, but I'm not sleepy. Nine o'clock, the lights go out. It's dark in here. Ten o'clock, scary shadows creep. <gasps> a monster friend will keep me safe. It's 11 o'clock. He should be asleep. 12 o'clock. It's midnight now. And here he is. Oh, is that his friend? 1 o'clock a.m. Oh, my monster brought a lot of friends. 2 o'clock a.m. Party time, they shout. Wait a minute. He's going to get in big time trouble. 3 o'clock a.m. Clap and dance, twirl and swing. 4 o'clock a.m. Climb and jump, fall and crash. Mm, I bet mom doesn't know about all of this. 5 o'clock a.m. It's about time you went away. 6 o'clock a.m. Now it's comfy, cozy time. Wait a minute. 7 o'clock a.m. Wake up time, a great big stretch. Time to start another day. The end. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? By Judy Sierra. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Mmm. Down by Bristol Cone Bay, where the little fish play. Mr. Crocodile Esquire is planning his day. Let's see what he's gonna do. Ooh, nine o'clock, wake up. 10 o'clock, eat breakfast. 11 o'clock, swim. 12 o'clock, go to town. One o'clock, visit the library. Two o'clock, shop for food. Three o'clock, bathe and snack. Four o'clock, catch those pesky monkeys. Five o'clock, cook those pesky monkeys. Six o'clock, eat those pesky monkeys. Seven o'clock, read a story. And eight o'clock, sing a lullaby to me. Mmm, there's a lot to do that day. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Time to wiggle my toes. Time to put on my clothes. Time to brush every tooth till it sparkles and glows. Look, it's nine o'clock. That's what he's going to do. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? It's 10 o'clock. It's time to start off my day at the Stingray Cafe with a barnacle bagel and a sea slug souffle. Ugh. Let's turn our page. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Time to plunge in the bay. Time to splash. Time to play. Time to practice my crocodile water ballet. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Time to roll into town. Time to swirl round and round. Time to skate right side up or yikes, upside down. <laughs> what time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Oh my goodness, the clock says it's one o'clock. Time to take a quick look for a recipe book. Hurry up, hurry up, I got monkeys to cook. Oh no. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? It's two o'clock. <gasps> time to shop where it's smart at the Crocodile Mall. How did all these bananas get into my cart? <sighs> what time is it, Mr. Crocodile? It's three o'clock. Time to soak, time to dream, time to plot, time to scheme, time to guzzle crop cola, and seaweed ice cream. Mmm. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Oh, it's four o'clock. Do you remember? That's when he said he was going to catch the monkeys. Let's see. 
Time to capture my meal as I sit at the wheel of my marvelous monkey collecting mobile. Oh no, he's trying to catch the monkey. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Oh my goodness, look, it's five o'clock. Time to cook, I'm too tired. I'm so, so uninspired. Cause my plan to catch monkeys completely backfired. Oh, look what happened to his machine, see that? What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? It's six o'clock. Time to say, I was rude with a bad attitude. I'd much rather have you as friends than as food. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? It's seven o'clock. Time to read about Fred who bumped his poor head and the five little monkeys that bounced on his bed. What time is it, Mr. Crocodile? Shh, it's eight o'clock. Time to sing a sweet tune neath the crocodile moon. Time to whisper, I hope you'll be coming back soon. Down by Bristlecone Bay, where the whiffle fish play, Mr. Crocodile Esquire is planning his day. Let's see what he's gonna do. Things to do tomorrow. Nine o'clock, wake up. 10 o'clock, eat breakfast. 11 o'clock, oh, teach monkeys to swim. That's good. 12 o'clock, go to town. 1 o'clock, visit the library. Get good monkey stories. 2 o'clock, shop for food. Lots of bananas. 3 o'clock, bath and snack. 4 o'clock, play with, play, play with those nice monkeys. Oh, that's much better. 5 o'clock, Cook for those nice monkeys. Six o'clock, eat with the nice monkeys. Seven o'clock, read a story, no bouncing together this time. And eight o'clock, sing a lullaby together. The end. I hope you had fun listening to fun stories about time and telling time today. You know what, we have plenty of books to choose from here at the library. Stop past and get yourself some more books that you can read or be read to in your spare time. And also, pick up the packet so you can make your own special oversized watch, okay? So until we see each other again, take care. Bye-bye.